After the epic scenario of stage 5, this Death Day stage comes as a relief for the 193 remaining riders. The profile of the course should suit the sprinters, but given the efforts made yesterday, maybe a breakaway can take the glory. There are four to try their luck in the front, Francis Arnaud Gérard and Jérôme Pinault, Spain's Swiss Angel Maté, and Tom Leeser of the Netherlands. The group is kept under close watch by the peloton, which never lets the frontman's gap be young 3 minutes 30. Alberto Contador has a smile on his face, but surely there was disappointment yesterday for him. While in the back, several sprinters hit the ground, Francis champion Arnaud Demar, then green jersey wearer Peter Sagan. François Hollande, the French president, follows the tradition of a visit on the tour and witnesses the end of the escapee's hopes. The sprinters' teams won this stage and start to accelerate towards the finish line in Reims. A speed pace which surprises the slowest riders at the back of the peloton. French climbers Thibaut Pinot and Pierre Roland lose almost one minute at the GC. In the front, Marcel Kittel is too weak after his crash yesterday to battle for the win. However, it's another German who crosses the line first. Andre Greipel grabs his first stage success in this 2014 tour. The French riders take four seats of the stage's top ten in front of the president. Peter Sagan is fifth and retains his green jersey. The first ten spots of the GC are at the same hands as yesterday. Nibali is still in yellow ahead of his teammate Fugelsang. The gaps with the main contenders are steady. Tomorrow's stage is a classic on the Tour de France between Epernay and Nancy. The Lorraine city hosts the Grand Book for the 17th time. The sprinters are used to shine in this arrival, but this time two Category 4 climbs in the last 20 kilometers might thwart their plans as the punchers could well dynamite the end of stage. Today, oh, first time in my career to be in the breakaway in the Tour was, was, was amazing. And, uh, yeah, unfortunately, uh, there was no chance on the result, but with all the people cheering and uh, yeah, still the Tour de France. Eh? Thank you.